It was a beautiful spring day on the island of Sodor. All the engines were bustling to and fro, carrying goods and passengers around the island. All, except for Thomas. He was helping workmen check all the signals on the line, and making sure they were operating properly. It was long and tedious work. Thomas enjoyed the rest, but soon he began to feel bored. Out of my way, Tiny Thomas! Express coming through! The Express is much more important than signal maintenance! Signals direct rail traffic. No engine can operate on a railway without them. Ha! <laughs> I'm not just any engine. I am fast. I am strong. I am Gordon. You are just Teeny Tiny Thomas. Teeny tiny engines are not useful anyway. Gordon left, leaving a very sad teeny tiny Thomas behind. All good here. Off we go. Come on, Thomas. Time to go. <sighs> yes, sir. Edward was at the station when Thomas chuffed slowly in. He could see that Thomas looked sad. Hello, Thomas. What's the matter? I'm not important like Gordon. He's fast, he's strong, he's... he's Gordon. Gordon is also too puffed up in his smoke box, let me remind you. Besides, you're a very helpful engine. I don't feel helpful. I feel... All clear. Let's go, Thomas. No, oh dear, the poor engine. Gordon must really have gotten to him. Later, Thomas saw Salty up ahead. Smoke was bellowing from his radiator. He didn't look happy. Hello, Salty. Are you alright? Ah, hello, Thomas. No, no, I'm not alright. My engine is overheated and I must deliver these fish vans to the docks before the fish spoils. I can take the fish for you. I have plenty of time while the workmen check the signals. Arr, thank you matey. You're very reliable. That lifted Thomas' spirits, but then he remembered what Gordon had said. I don't feel that reliable. I only feel like teeny tiny Thomas. <laughs> Thomas chuffed down the line towards the docks. On the way, he passed a signal that hadn't been checked. It's only one signal. I'm sure it's okay. At least it should be for now. At the docks, Thomas was waiting to be uncoupled from the vans when Gordon cruised by. Out of my way! Tiny Thomas! Express coming through! Thomas watched as Gordon picked up speed and sped off into the distance. He wished he was Gordon, but he wouldn't for long. About a half a mile past the unchecked signal, Bill and Ben were stopped to allow Terence and his trailer to cross the line. As the trailer crossed, its wheels caught between the rails. It was stuck. Gordon was thundering down the line, making good time. Up ahead stood the unchecked signal. Its arm showed clear, but the line ahead was blocked, unbeknownst to Gordon. Express coming through! Gordon charged ahead. He passed the signal and rounded the bend. Suddenly he could see Bill and Ben's trucks on the line ahead. Look out! It was too late. Gordon crashed and smashed into the trucks. Luckily, no one was hurt, but there was a terrible mess. Thomas was on his way back down the line when he saw the wreckage. Cinders and ashes! Are you alright, Gordon? Luckily for you, Thomas, I'm fine, but my side rods are damaged. Now I can't pull the express! None of this would have happened if that signal hadn't read clear. Oh no. This is all my fault. 
I knew I should have checked that signal earlier. Uh, but don't worry, Gordon. I caused this mess, so I'll fix it. Wish me luck. You'll need all the help you can get, Tiny Tunnel. Henry arrives to take away the express, and Thomas sets off to collect the breakdown crane. He left the crane at the scene of the accident, and brought the workmen to the faulty signal for repairs. Soon the wreckage was cleared away, and Thomas helped Gordon back to the sheds. Thomas arrived back at the sheds, tired and unhappy. The other engines could see it. What's wrong, Thomas? I'm not really useful like Gordon. I'm not as fast as Gordon, I'm not as strong as Gordon, and I caused a silly accident all because I didn't check one signal. I don't feel like a really useful engine at all. But Thomas, you are a really useful engine, and a helpful one at that. You help the workmen check and repair all the signals on Sodor. And you delivered my fish to the docks. On time, I might add. That makes you helpful and very reliable, me arty. And, although you caused my accident, you cleared the wreckage and helped me home. You also taught me a lesson about signals. They are essential for the success and safety of a railway. You are helpful, reliable, and really useful. Three cheers for Thomas, the really useful engine. Hip hip hooray! Hip hip hooray! Hip hip hooray!